Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching this video. So in today's video, we'll discuss how to run your ads um, more effectively in 2021, how to get more conversions and how to reach out to more people. So now there are uh, different ways of running ads using your uh, Facebook business manager. You can run single image ads, you can run carousel ads, or you can run collection ads. But today what, I, what I'm going to give you is that how to run multiple ads uh, within one campaign. Uh, you can create different ad sets, you can create multiple uh, audiences and you, within, within one campaign and you can run ads. So now I'll guide you step by step how to target different audiences within the one ad, within the one campaign using the same budget. For instance, you're spending about $20 on a campaign roughly. So you'll be showing five to 10 different ads within that same budget to different people. Facebook will automatically find out which ad is performing uh, better than the other ads and it'll show that ad to more people and will push that audience further rather than the other ones. So in order to do that, just follow these steps. Go to your business manager. So just click on your ads manager and over here, just click on create. So just click on conversion ads. So basically conversion ads, um, you should run once you have enough data in your pixel. Um, so Facebook can actually run this, uh, this sort of campaigns for you. If you don't have much data to your pixel or if you don't have much conversions on a website already. So just try and run traffic ads, engagement ads and other ads so you can get more audiences and then you'll be able to run the conversion ads. So click and continue. And over here, just create a single image ad. Leave the campaign um, budget optimization for now. I'll show you in the next video how to do that. So just click on next website and over here just click on purchase as our goal or objective is to sell our products or services so just choose a budget that's more appropriate that leave it to 4000 rupees and just use the same audience for instance i've created one so this audience is basically um about it's it's targeting certain cities and certain um, age and you know all that details so just click on next so over here you just choose your instagram which is already connected to your facebook business manager if you haven't connected it yet just please refer to my previous video so you can do that easily so over here um just uncheck this dynamic formats and we we'll choose the single image ad so over here add media add image and you can select any single image that you think will perform better than the other one so for instance we can just choose this covid one and we we'll just click on done so over here we'll just put a primary test covid So over here, just choose the call to action button, which should be book now because they're booking for the tests and here you can just paste the link of that certain service. So people don't go to any other website and they just log on to your website, which is premium diagnostics. Right, so after that, your pixel is already connected. So this is, this, if you click on publish, so this algorithm will publish. Now, once you have published this, just click here and duplicate this um, ad. Click on duplicate. And over here, just change the name to carousel so you can remember. 
and from single image to carousel and here just select the items for instance covid test just put the headline the primary text the website link so choose the best 10 images uh, you think are going to get you the more um, conversions or more traffic to your website so once you have done that again click over here duplicate it and you can choose you change the name and put it to collection ads and over here just click on collection choose a template storefront right so you can leave the products um, dynamically as well if you have um, made the product sets you can choose those so just click on here so it'll basically show all the products to your um, audiences and over here just click book now and just paste the link to your website over here and then just click on done so this is how you have created different ad sets within one campaign now the next step is um, targeting different audiences within the same So rather than dynamic video, you can also choose an image and you can just upload the image and you can choose this bit over here and you just, this is how it's going to show you to your, uh, this is how I'll show you to your, uh, show to your audiences, click on done. Now, so your one ad um, set is complete. So over here where you see new conversion ad set, click over here, duplicate it. Right, so you'll see the same ad sets already in there. So all you got to do is from here, just choose create new audience. Um, I would suggest create new custom audience. Choose website next so from here using your pixel choose those people who are from the last 180 days um, all website visitors so you'll be retargeting in this ad retargeting and create audience and just click on done so similarly um, you have now created two different audiences you can again duplicate it and you can create a lookalike audience. So just click over here, create new audience, lookalike audience, and just keep it to 5% or 1% depending upon your, um, your needs. Uh, this is PD pixel purchase and then just click on create audience right so after that just click on publish so now you're basically targeting three different audiences and three set of different ads within one campaign so if you're not sure on which ads to promote which artworks or which creatives to promote so over here you can select uh, you know different um, ad sets and you can target different audiences and Facebook will automatically push your ads to those people who are more likely to shop or those audiences uh, which are more um, which are generating more response for instance um, a single image is performing uh, within your lookalike audiences so Facebook will push that uh, your carousel is performing better uh, when it comes to retargeting so Facebook will push push to that so in my next video I'll show you how to create uh, custom audiences, uh, different audiences and how to use those for Facebook and Instagram to retarget your customers as well. Thank you.